Hey, what's up you guys? It's Judy here with My Life as Geek Guy, and in today's video, I'm going to be doing the five minute full face of makeup challenge. On this channel, I create videos on product reviews, makeup tutorials, and lifestyle advice with the aim to entertain, educate, and enrich the lives of others. So if you're new here, please consider subscribing. I would love for you to join the Geek Guy family. And if you're returning here to my channel, then welcome back. I'm really pleased to be saying that today's video is being done in collaboration with my longtime friend here on YouTube, Liz Quico. Liz is also a small YouTuber like myself here on this platform, and Liz creates a lot of informative videos about life in New Zealand. She does a lot of videos and mommy tips as well and also makeup videos. Liz and I have been friends on this platform for a long, long time, almost since the absolute beginning of when both of us started our YouTube channels. I remember on my very first live stream, Liz was one of two people <laughs> that was there with me on my live stream and I think that's kind of how we connected. We've been in touch ever since. I think that was around the time when I was at maybe 200 subscribers and Liz was at around about the same and we've been friends ever since. Liz has just hit over a thousand subscribers on her YouTube channel so congratulations Liz I'm so incredibly happy for you and we decided it was finally time to do a collab because we've been talking about it for a long long time just never got around to doing it but here we are finally today is the day we threw around a few ideas for our collab video today and we finally settled upon the five minute full face of makeup challenge now Liz said to me you choose the photo that we're both going to try and you know recreate and I chose a makeup look that I thought would be achievable within five minutes but Liz said it it looks too easy. It looks too easy. Let's give ourselves a challenge. Let's make it a challenge. So, so this is the photo that we both agree upon. It is a photo that was taken from the Instagram profile Makeup X Claudia. I'm going to also leave her Instagram listed in the description box down below because we want to give credit where credit is due. I'm getting hot now. <laughs> this video is gonna be fun. Let's get excited. Obviously, it's not gonna be a very long video. It's gonna be a five minute makeup challenge. I've got my things laid out in front of me here. Easy reach, easy grab, so that I can try and create this look with as much ease as possible. And uh, I guess there's not much more to say. Besides, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you are new here. If you are not new here and you just keep returning, may as well hit that subscribe button. Come on now, ring that notification bell because I put out three videos every single week. You can also follow me on social media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. All of them are life as geek guys. So I've already got my face moisturized because that's how I start anyway. That's not cheating, right? That's that's not cheating. I've already got my face moisturized. <laughs> so I've got my foundation concealer powder contour stick because I don't care how quick this makeup look is going to be. I got to have some shape in my face. So contour, bronzer, highlight blush eyeshadow make sure i've got brushes for my bronzer and blush okay i think i am ready here we go five minutes i'm gonna set my timer i better turn off my heater i'm already sweating <laughs> it's ready i'm kind of nervous <laughs> okay ready set go i'm not gonna be talking through the steps because ain't nobody got time priming my T-zone. Why is my hand freezing up? I'm so nervous. Like, oh my gosh. I'm so nervous. I'm nervous. Come on, you're a professional. You can do this. You have done makeup in really quick before. gosh minutes almost gone all right so we're just gonna go we're gonna go for a full face of makeup but like really not too full coverage I guess maybe so she said full face of makeup right so we're doing a full face makeup contour the whole shebang I would not normally recommend dragging your your what's it what's the word I can't even think contour down your neck like that because that's gonna make your neck sag and give you wrinkles. But you nobody got time to think about wrinkles right now. Except all those people doing those face app old people photos. Oh my gosh, this much 
pounding on my face is gonna give me wrinkles, legit wrinkles, and who needs the app for that? If you're used to doing your minute in five, your makeup, if you're used to doing your makeup in five minutes, also this five minutes, no edits because like, what, what kind of challenge is that? Three minutes down, I mean three minutes, three minutes left. Oh my gosh, my arm is seizing up. All right, powder. Don't breathe in when you're doing powder. Never a good idea. I could probably use a big fluffy brush for my powder, but the only big fluffy brush I have smells like horse, and I don't feel like dying gagging on camera right now from the smell. <laughs> All right, so that powder done. I'm gonna go in with my dark pressed foundation for bronzer. Oh gosh, my face base taking me three minutes. Still gotta do the eyes. Okay, blush. It's probably like the quickest makeup look I've ever filmed ever. Uh, highlight. Ooh, why am I putting highlight on my? Oh shit! <laughs> ah! Oh gosh! Not on the cheeks, darling. Not on the cheeks. Okay. Um, I'm sucking at this already. Uh, eyeshadow. This is not even anywhere close to that makeup look. I need to stop talking. Down to crunch time. Oh, shit. It's racing so fast right now. I'm gonna worry about eyeliner. That's already fucked in out the window. I don't have lipstick with me. Um, uh, quickest one. Oh, right here, right here. It's not even anywhere close to what was in the makeup look, but I forgot to set it out. Time for uh, a bit more mascara and oh my gosh The quickest makeup look ever. What do you reckon? What do you reckon? <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't need this kind of stress in my life. That was stressful AF, man. I have got highlighter in all the wrong places on my face. Uh, I've got it like literally under my eyes. Let's do a montage. Why not? Let's do a montage. <laughs> you guys, I'll bring you up close and personal and you can see what shit of a job I did. <laughs> Well, um, that's probably the quickest video I've ever filmed in my life. Uh, there's not much more to say. I used the foundation that I knew would not fail me and didn't need a lot of blending, and that is my go to. I don't even know where it is now. Where did, oh, here it is. <laughs> That's my L'Oreal Infallible Matte Foundation. It blends in beautifully, blends in really nice, even if I had to kind of like, wow, I've got lippy all over my teeth. Even though I had to kind of like swipe it all over my face instead of pat it. The base isn't bad, considering on how quickly and slapdash I did it. The concealer blended in nicely. That was the Maybelline A True Wine Concealer that always blends in really nicely. So it goes to show, it's not terrible. I mean, 
it's probably the worst eye job I've ever done as far as eyeshadow and mascara goes but it's not terrible it just goes to show that if you've got the right products that work for you and that blend in really nicely work well with your skin tone then you can do a really really quick makeup look as far as recreating the look in the photo I'm afraid I didn't do it anywhere close to justice <laughs> it was a beautiful photo on a beautiful girl and while I'm not saying I'm not a beautiful girl it is not beautiful makeup I don't feel very pretty right now <laughs> but it wasn't too bad considering just goes to show I can do a very quick full face of makeup full face of makeup I have absolutely no excuse to be late for any event <laughs> that requires the wearing of makeup <laughs> So anyway, I guess that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for being here. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. I'm going to leave Liz's video linked in the description box down below so you can go check it out. I just want to say how incredibly thankful I am to be able to have this platform and to be able to make the friendships and connections that I have here on YouTube, such as the one that I have with Liz. I'm so very thankful for Liz. She has been a longtime subscriber and friend here on my YouTube channel and on my Instagram and just sending messages in life in general. She's very encouraging and inspiring to me. She is a full-time mom. She works a full-time job and she also has time to create videos and upload them on her YouTube channel. So she's incredibly hardworking and inspiring to me. It would mean the world to me and I'm sure Liz would truly appreciate it if you headed on over to her channel and checked out her video. Show her some love, give her video a thumbs up and comment in her video and tell her that Judy sent you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for being here. I really truly appreciate that you've chosen to spend your time here with me today. I'll See you guys in my next video. Bye! <laughs> I think this whole entire video is one big messing blooper. I have here on YouTube. <laughs>